Oh, this is the new Oposata Hall in Bad Banana Chart. It's basically uh, finished and we're getting ready for the big opening ceremony. I will very simply walk you all around once that you get a good feeling what it looks like. A beautiful sandstone Buddha statue using an Indian Buddha statue of the Gupta period as a model. But uh, manufactured in Thailand. John Kevali did an excellent job. You may notice also the lighting has been installed very sophisticated and beautifully. Here we have the Buddha statue. The flowers from our Avita chanting and welcoming Lumpur Anek, one of the most senior monks of our tradition of Ajahn Chah. Try to go right in front of the Buddha statue that you get a feeling. Ah, uh, yeah, here we are right in front. Very beautiful. That is the Gupta period sandstone copy done here in Thailand. Here, right in the center of the Oposato Hall, one of the ceremonial Sima stones, which will be uh, lowered by the king himself at the ceremony coming up in a few days outside quite a number more ceremonial Sima stones. People like to come and put gold leafing on them. You see at each of the markers you find one of the ceremonial stones which will be lowered on the day of the ceremony. We continue our little walk around. Here we are again. Can go up that you get a feeling of the architecture, the beautiful lighting arrangement. Buddha statue, the center area for the monks. It is very open, a beautiful cooling breeze coming through. You may be interested to know that there is no structural timber in this Oposata Hall. Everything is built from concrete, even the beautiful ceiling here in the center is actually colored concrete, as far as I know, not wood, to make it long last and to be fully safe against termites and other damage, fire. Also here the woodwork is actually not woodwork, but uh, all structural concrete. Once more, the central area, very beautiful. Walk around in front, you can see a little Buddha statue. There again, devotees are coming and affixing little gold leaf. And you can see how they have put so much gold leaf that the shape of the Buddha is already changing and no longer fully recognizable. central ceremonial stone which will be lowered by the king on the main day. And maybe we can walk around externally that you will get an idea what it looks like outside. 
beautiful inside, beautiful outside. Uh, this is the little staircase where one can enter. Where we go up, but you can see the wolf, traditional style, and crowned by the wolf structure, which is symbolizing the Buddhist cosmos according to Buddhist cosmology. Also outside, the lighting very beautifully done, not blinding, but showing all the features of the architecture perfectly. You must see it in real, it's even more beautiful when you see it in real.